All right. Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to Marathon Mondays with Mal. Mal Williams here at the Coburg, Oregon Marathon Coach location. We are sitting in 1275. This is a quad eight shell. Woo! We are in 1275. This is Ernie with the paint shop. Andy, and you guys have met Andy before. Andy's the head of our paint shop, and we are rolling out of the production bay with 1275. The quad slide, this is a custom coach, and we are headed to the paint shop. So, why are we doing this? Well, I'm going to tell you. We are going to visit with 1275 throughout the entire process of production. Starting with today, this is the first episode with the quad slide Marathon Coach 1275 and we're going to follow it all the way through production and today it's headed off to paint. Andy, it's been here what, about a week? Uh, going on two weeks. Going on two weeks. Yeah. So for the last two weeks they've been prepping it to head on down to paint and it's going to go down to paint. Ernie's driving it down and everybody just so you know today is Ernie's three year anniversary with Marathon Coach. That's, that's, a, that's a big achievement, that's pretty awesome. Don't wreck the coach. Yeah, so, I'll try that. so don't <laughs> watch out for all potholes, right? So we are going to be following this coach through the process. This coach was custom ordered by a marathon owner who has owned marathon coaches uh, several, several times. And uh, I'm pretty excited about this. Al Christensen, I believe, is the uh, designer along with the owner. It being custom, the uh, owner. Uh, had a lot of input on it, and that's going to be really fun. Um, at, se at some point throughout this series, we'll probably have him uh, on speakerphone talking about the, the process of ordering a coach, the process of uh, picking out fabrics and backsplashes and flooring and you name it. But we are headed into paint today, and we wanted to take this opportunity to uh, document it. So here we go. Okay, excellent. So Andy's going to jump out and guide Ernie in to the uh, bay here. All right, so heading in here right in front of Bay 3. This is a, this is a bay where they do a lot of the taping off and the masking. A lot of grinding too. What's that? A lot of grinding. A lot of grinding happens. We do all the composites here too. Okay, so the composites and the grinding happens happening happens in here. <laughs> oh. Curbside of the bedroom. 
Now let's go back and take a look. So the slide has gone out on the curb side of the bedroom. And this is where the bed is going to be. And I know it's a little dark in here, but this is where the bed's going to be. So let's head on out and... The front ones are coming out shortly. These are going to come out? Yeah. Okay. So we're going to stand right here in the middle as these two uh, slides move out here in the salon area. So this is an exciting thing because this coach was custom ordered by a customer and he's giving us the opportunity to document this coach being built from the ground up as you see it as a shell all the way to the last day when the owner takes it um, takes it and takes it right off onto the road. So that's pretty exciting and uh, we really appreciate him giving us the opportunity uh, to profile it on Marathon Mondays. Sutton, who designs the paint, the paint jobs. Uh, we've talked to Paul from the paint shop before on Marathon Mondays. You know, our guys are extremely talented. I was at the FMCA event in Indianapolis at the fairgrounds last week, and the paint job on 1258, uh, which is also a quad slide bus that's for sale, it, it, it's an absolutely amazing paint job. It almost looks three-dimensional. Um, so our paint guys, our, the entire paint team, from the design to all the guys that actually do the applying of the paint, extremely talented, and you wouldn't expect anything less out of Marathon. And there goes the other slide. So both slides are out here on the front in the in the salon and in the bedroom. So now you can see how much room is in here. And I think we're going to head outside and see what's going on out here. I'm just tall enough. <laughs> All the slides are pulled out of 1275 and we're taking a quick look around the outside here. So this is the composite and masking room. Like Andy says, it'll be here for eight days. Getting masked up, getting the composites put on, the roof cap. Let's take a look around the back side. So 23 days in paint. And day number one is Monday. It's Monday today, though, man. That's right. <laughs> you gotta love Monday. 
We apologize for the lighting and uh, some of the audio while we were inside, but well, you guys, you gotta you gotta give us some credit. We're bringing you the the uh, the inside look at it, and sometimes the lighting's not the best, and sometimes the audio is not the best. Uh, but we're working on it. So the composite room. Well, there it is, you got the four slides. So what's the process now? How many days do you have it for now? 23. 23 days. Working days, yes. 23 working days. So let me ask you this. It's a quad slide. This is the largest bus that we do. Correct. So tell me, is 23 days a stretch? Because I know that there's a lot of work that goes into it. For this, this coach, so yeah. It is. Because of the paint job that's been selected? Uh, yes. Okay. It's got can it's got candy, it's got textures, and uh, it's got four slide outs that the paint needs to run through the slide outs. The, so the paint does run, so it's not like a solid color on no. the slide outs. Customers always like the uh, paint run through the slide outs. Okay. So the transitions go through. Correct. So, um, gosh, it's uh, it's the beginning of 23 days for you. Does this count as a day for you? Uh, technically, no. Technically, no. Good. That's good. So Monday, Monday will be the first starting date on it. Beautiful. Well, we really appreciate your time, Andy. Uh, we're going to come back probably within the week and check on the progress. Um, what what happens in the first week that 1275 is going to be with you? First thing we do is we take the bumpers off, running lights, entry door handles, uh, door locks. And uh, after that, we mask off the windows and start adding the composites. Uh, Roof cap, uh, front end, uh, okay. addition, and um, after that, starts prepping the whole entire coach. How long does that process take to do pre all the prep work that you have to do? Eight days. Eight days. Is that when it's ready to go in the paint booth? Into the booth. Yep. Okay. The eighth, and the eight day goes in the paint booth. That's exciting. Well, this is going to be fun. So, welcome to Marathon Coach 1275. We're going to be following it through its process of manufacturing. And we're excited about it. Andy, thank you again. Uh, and to Ernie, who uh, already took off. Uh, big thanks to him on his three-year anniversary here at Marathon. So we'll see you back on Marathon Mondays with Mal.